Excuse me, uh, to, to the spring concert program tonight. And the students who are performing tonight have worked very hard in preparation for this concert. And we are excited to share with you our progress that we've made throughout the school year. Before we begin, I would please ask that you take a moment and you silence all of your electronic devices. I think I heard a ding just now. Please respect the performers by staying in your seat. And should you need to leave for any reason, please try to do so between songs to avoid disturbing the performers or other audience members. Refrain from conversation during the musical selections. And lastly, please take children who need extra attention to the lobby area in the back. Tonight's performers will include the sixth grade, seventh grade, and eighth grade band. And we'll be celebrating their accomplishments this year and acknowledging the students who earned band awards. After the sixth grade performance, the sixth graders will be dismissed from the concert. They can go put their things away uh, back in the choir room area and place them in the storage area. We will pick things up tomorrow during the, the school day, during band hour. If sixth graders would like to stay for seventh and eighth grade, they're welcome to do so, but they must be accompanied by an adult. And now, without further ado, please join me in welcoming the Leg Middle School sixth grade band. I've had the pleasure of working with Miss Scheidler this year, um, and uh, she's kind of learned the ropes to becoming a band director a little bit, um, learning under me, and it's been a real privilege to have her this year. Um, you'll see her a little bit later in the evening with seventh and eighth grade as well, um, but uh, this, uh, this, this concert season has been really cool to have her more involved in the rehearsal process and uh, getting her up to here to conduct some pieces, so that's really cool. Our second piece tonight is Shockwave, and it is an aggressive number. The kids really dig it, and it features our percussion.
Okay, it's come, come time for that magical moment where we announce the band awards for the year. So, we give out three awards in band, and all three of these awards are voted on by their peers. I just set it up in Google Classroom, and we make a day out of it, and we vote on all the awards. So, um, it's really cool to see what the kids think because they're right on the money, like 99.9% .9 of the time. It's great. So, um, anyway, uh, the first award that we're going to give out here at Leg Middle School is going to be the Most Improved Award. And this award goes to the student displaying the most musical improvement as voted by the class. And this award winner is Maya McBride. Center. Okay, next, the Outstanding Musicianship Award. This award goes to a student displaying the top level of musicianship on their instrument. And this award winner is Ellie Augenbaugh. And last but not least, the Outstanding Band Person, the top award at the LMS Band Program. And this award goes to its student displaying several characteristics, including top musicianship, academic achievement, and is considered the leader of their section, or at least one of them. They are also a team player and display the highest level of responsibility and respect as voted on by their peers. And the Outstanding Band Person Award goes to Mackinson Berry. <laughs> One more round of applause. The sixth grader's last piece is called Coldwater Creek. So we're going to finish with that, and then seventh grade, it'll be your shot up here.
digging that first tune, Majestica. Really cool. Really nice overture. Um, I would regret it if I didn't talk about um, what happened in March. Um, that was our band festival. Um, the seventh grade band members, we traveled to Marshall High School to participate in MSBOA Band Festival. Band Festival is a very important time for band students. We prepare several pieces and perform them for judges who rate us on a score of one through five. In the Coldwater Band Program, we strive for those ones and twos. The seventh grade band did not disappoint. They earned a Division I rating classified by MSBOA as a superior performance. Tonight, in celebration of this accomplishment, the seventh graders are wearing their medals they earned that day. Congratulations, seventh grade band. I'd also like to take a second and recognize the students who participated in Solon Ensemble this year. This is an optional opportunity we have in band. These students learned a piece of music in addition to the regular band music and performed for a judge on Saturday, April 20th at Gull Lake Middle School. I am pleased to announce that every student at that, that attended that event, uh, the Cold Water Band Program, earned a Division I rating. Students, when I call your name, if you could please stand and be acknowledged. Congratulations to the following students. Ashlyn Avery, Christian Briscoe, Kaylin Lafty, and Bethany Utrecht. Our next number, I decided to uh, take a bit of a risk and give the students a smooth and expressive number. Uh, so this is, uh, this is a, a song called uh, Irish Tune from County Derry.
love that tune. Wasn't that great? All right. Now it's time for the seventh grade awards. The most improved award, of course, goes to the student displaying the most musical improvement, as voted by the class once again. So the most improved award for seventh grade goes to Giovanna Capella. Outstanding Musicianship Award. This goes to the student displaying the top level musicianship on their instrument. This goes to Ashlyn Avery. <laughs> Last but not least, the top award in the LMS band program. The Outstanding Band Person Award for seventh grade is Bethany Utrecht. <laughs> One more round of applause. Yeah. Very cool. This last piece is a march in cut time. I like to give my seventh graders a cut time march uh, so that we can, uh, they can get used to reading rhythms in cut time. And uh, this next piece will be conducted by Miss Scheidler. Let's welcome her to the stage, please. We're going to do another transition to eighth grade, and we will be right back with you.
This next tune is kind of a gag. It's called Tool Time Tango. So uh, we have a couple of our percussion students, instead of playing on normal percussion instruments, they're playing on cordless drills. So um, I'm going to be featuring them as soloists up here. Um, and uh, you know, it's supposed to be it's supposed to be humorous. So you know, make make sure you laugh. All right. But it's a we're, we're, it's it's a tango. So you know, it's a dance. Um, but instead of you know serious instruments, it's cordless drills. Hey, can we demonstrate how those sound? Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. All right. Okay. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy Tool Time Tango. Like the 7th grade band, the 8th grade band also traveled to Marshall High School to participate in MSBOA Band Festival. The 8th grade earned a Division II rating, classified as an excellent performance by MSBOA. Tonight, in celebration of this accomplishment, the 8th graders are wearing their medals they earned that day. Congratulations, 8th grade band. And like seventh grade, I'd like to take a second to recognize the students who participated in Solar Ensemble. Once again, every single LMS band student that went to and traveled to uh, Gull Lake Middle School to participate in Solar Ensemble earned a Division I rating. So students, when I call your name, please stand and be recognized. Giselle McDonald, Ivan McConnell, Risa Renshaw, and Catherine Smith. Some of those kids, you see how many medals they're wearing? Holy smokes, you see that? 
My goodness, some of them have like six or seven of them on. It's crazy. So over the years, they've earned a lot of them. All right. So this next tune here is going to be conducted by Miss Scheidler. Once again, we're going to bring her back up here. But before she does, I just wanted to say what a pleasure it was to have Emily Scheidler work with me here at LEG this year. She has assisted me this year in many ways, from leading class when I happen to be absent, rehearsing with the kids, running sectionals, playing along on every instrument from clarinet to French horn. Ms. Scheidler has been a huge asset to the LMS band program this year. We will definitely miss her, but wish her well on her future endeavors and hope that music will always be a part of what she does. Thank you, Ms. Scheidler. Okay, this next one is called Legend of Fort Apache, and once again will be conducted by the one and only Miss Scheidler. Give just one more round of applause for Miss Scheidler. <laughs> and the eighth grade awards. The most improved award for eighth grade goes to Ivan McConnell. The Outstanding Musicianship Award goes to Rory Simpson. <laughs> and last but not least, the Outstanding Band Person Award goes to Risa Renshaw.
One more round of applause for the award winners. Well done. Yeah, you guys are good, thank you. Before we wrap up here, just a couple thank yous that I have. First off, thank you for coming to the concert tonight and supporting uh, local music, your local music program here, um, both at CHS and at LMS. Thank you so much for being here. I'd also like to thank a few individuals. I'd like to thank Katie Jewell. Um, she's uh, been back here helping me out with the, uh, with the awards and getting everything situated back here and keeping everything uh, running smoothly. Um, I'd like to thank Emily Scheidler, of course. Jacob Simmons, the choir director, the band boosters for helping support our band program and funding, helping us fund it, the LMS and CHS administration, the custodial staff who will be here cleaning up after we're done here tonight, and then I'd like to thank Sean Watson for being here tonight and recording our concert so that we can reflect and uh, review that and get better. So one round of applause for those individuals, please. Our final piece tonight is Starfire Fanfare. It's a 6-8 piece. Love to give the 8th grade a 6-8 number, so this is that one. Hope you enjoyed tonight's concert. Thank you for joining us this year and for your support, and we hope to see you next year. Thank you.